Hey Gemini, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're all doing great. So this is another love reading for October. Let's take a look and see what is coming your way in love. My name is Lynn and this is Passion Heart Tarot. If it's your first time to my channel, thank you for clicking on the video, Gemini. Or if you're cross watching, welcome you guys. Let's jump right in and see what is coming in for Gemini's love life. Before I begin your reading, I'm gonna take a moment to invite the white light though. There's just a lot of energy coming through. Um, that's a strong message to some of you. If you're wondering if you should walk away from a connection, the answer is yes, because it's something that really brings a shift in. And I can see where the timing is exactly right to do it. So this is really a specific message for some of you that have been thinking of doing this. Gemini, I can also see Sagittarius energy coming through. So you guys might have that uh, moon or rising. Maybe you're a cross watcher here. Maybe you just uh, are a cross watcher who has that moon or rising. But I just see like an inevitable breakup and someone choosing to be single choosing to walk away choosing to do what it takes to make their own heart feel better and it's funny the way that like walking away brings so much success it really turns the tables in something that you've like waited long enough that's what spirit is showing me and telling me like you've waited long enough you can't keep holding on you can't keep waiting for this it's actually time to let yourself embark on a new journey. So that's really, really important. That's an important message for someone who is wondering if they should walk away from a particular connection. And, and you have a lot of benefits and a lot of success that are gonna come to you if you do. Let's, let's look even further and see what is going on with others of you because I just feel like that is um, someone who needs that last nudge into making a choice. Walking away is the right choice because I think it's going to make someone see your value. Okay, Gemini, let's take a look at and see what spirit shows us is coming in for you all for October. I mean, it's just like the same message repeating. So I know that's just what I'm meant to tell you guys. Cause I, you know, I'm trying to see um, another message for what's going on with others of you. But the message here from spirit is like, it's really time to see the truth about someone. See the truth about the offer that they're making you. Because I've seen this um, couple come through before and they are not a couple gemini you could just be in a position right now where you are settling for someone who's just not a match for you i mean they're really not an empress is not going to get matched with a page of cups those are two completely different energies it's like someone who's ready for that like major step major step into a connection that will ultimately lead to like building something with someone getting married building a family building a life together and i just see where you might start to realize as this person shows you like when they're showing you who they are believe it try not to make excuses for this person 
try not to i know where um when you want something to work out you can make excuses for them and but what i'm telling you is that is is not something that you should do it's like just this energy over and over and over of you've waited long enough and um, I know where you're in this energy of being frustrated, like everything that I've invested and I'm just not getting back what I thought I would. I know I'm I know you're going to start to realize that you're not getting back what you deserve. And, and I still see the same message repeating of like when you take that choice to walk away, it's something that brings so much relief to your heart. I wonder if some of you are settling because you're rebounding from something i see that energy here of maybe just like maybe just like wanting a connection for the sake of being in a, in a connection because maybe you don't want to be alone but i i see where you might decide that it's just not right for you it's just not working out I mean, the bottom line is like you guys are way too different. You're in different places um, emotionally, spiritually, even as far as your uh, emotional intelligence, you're in two different places. Because I just see this as um, someone who is insincere, who maybe wants to be a match for you, who wants to try and um, give you what it is that... I don't know, maybe they want to, but maybe they're younger and they just can't like uh, reach your level, so to speak. And I'm not I'm not saying that they're a bad person. I'm just saying that they're, you guys are not right for each other and holding on to it. You might be holding on to it longer than you actually should. But I know for some of you watching, you're looking for that clarity of when it's time to let go. And I can see that it is time for you to let go. Because in, in a way, you are not going to get, you're not going to get back what you're putting into this. And your efforts are best suited elsewhere. All right, you guys, I want to look at this page of God. That's interesting. Oh man. Like I said, I know that they're they're not a bad person, but maybe you yeah, I think that walking away is something that you need to do in order for this person in order for this person to grow into who they're meant to be to be a match for you so if, if cross watcher you might feel uh this way about gemini like you want gemini to um be the one that blossoms and develops more to be a match for you i know that it's not done i know that what needs to happen is this period of separation so the growth can come in because remember at the beginning of the reading when we saw that walking away actually has so many benefits um because you've waited long enough for this person to to like reach your vibration so so this is not it's not to put anyone here down because you guys are just in different places it doesn't mean that you won't be on the same frequency soon enough i can just see that you have to walk away in order to bring that change to this person because you guys are in this twin soul connection so i was really hesitant about like saying that like, like they're insincere that's why i'm like well maybe they just are like younger or they're just like not on your level and a lot of that has to do with um vibrationally for some of you this person is younger and they just have like growing growing up to do um learning our responsibilities creating like stability for themselves so those of you that know that you are like in love with a younger person i can see that the time is not right and you you kind of have to give them um more time to come into their own and the message from spirit is like it's it's the right thing to do you've you've put in enough time and now like walking away 
is something that's actually it might even be tough love it might even force this person into growing up the way that they should and you know that's not necessarily a negative thing i just see where you guys are so different you're so different and you really really are in two different places they just need time to come into their own because for you you are already uh, you already are very comfortable. You know who you are, what you're looking for, what you have to offer. And this is a person who's still in the energy of figuring things out. So, of course, you guys have had lifetime after lifetime of um, relationships together. That's why there's such an incredible pull. That's why it might be really hard for you to walk away. But then there's like something from within that tells you that you should. You should listen to that voice because walking away is... Although it might hurt at the time, it's something that's going to be a blessing in disguise, especially for the way that this person kind of needs the energy of the loss in order to, I, I see where they just might need that, like that force, that nudge, you know, pushing the baby bird from the nest so it can fly. It's like that kind of energy because they just can't give to you what you want right now. I, I see it, but it's not because of, it's not really because of like something that you're lacking. It's, and yes, they are lacking, but it's not a negative thing. They just need time. They just need time to grow into who they're meant to be. And I know where you, um, because you're so secure, you might say, well, they should know what they want. I know that that's easy to say, but that's just not their energy. So they don't necessarily have to be younger than you. You're just in two different places as far as your spiritual development. So for those of you um, wondering like if you should walk away, you should. That's the message from Spirit because it's like a blessing in disguise. It makes this person see um, that things are not guaranteed it makes this person value. It makes this person really think about, you know, the effort that they were putting in the whole time uh, when they could have done so much more. And I know that eventually you guys are meant to come back around together. So don't think that it has to be like this long drawn out process of separation. It all depends on how fast this person is willing to acknowledge their feelings, acknowledge your feelings and learn. For some of them, it could be like within a couple weeks. Do you know what I mean? Don't don't fear like if you walk away, you're going to lose them forever. Walking away is something that gets the connection on the right track. It's what brings in so much success between the two of you. All right, you guys, let's look at this. Let's look at this Empress's energy. I mean, it's um, something that's that's meant to happen between the two of you in time. In time, I can see, I can see where this can can result in something major. There's energy coming through of like a spouse, energy coming through of marriage, like a wish being fulfilled, coming together and and really creating something. So maybe you just need to take a break from things, take that time apart to make this person step up to the plate. Because I know that once you do choose to walk away, they are going to step up to the plate. But if you keep like staying in the same uh, vibration with them, even kind of lowering yourself to their vib vibration when you shouldn't, no change is going to happen. It's like when you walk away, a, a flip is switched and it turns all of the energy around. That is what I can see. That's really important for you to know, Gemini. A blessing, it's a blessing in disguise. I'm not saying that it's the easiest thing to do, but I also know that you guys will come back together and then this person can finally be the match that 
they're all they're always supposed to be it's just like the the timing is not right for that because they have more growth that they need to do okay gemini it's just something to think about it's just something for you all to think about because i know that those are not the easiest messages to hear and i did try to pull another message for you guys but it's like the same thing coming through again about um how when you do walk away it actually uh brings in a lot of success to the connection. So don't be afraid that you're gonna lose this person. You'll never lose them. You guys are connected, uh, you have like these soul ties, all of this past life energy between the two of you. And you know, please don't think that I, I mean to put that person down. I kinda do, um, like I, I question this energy but I also know that it just might be, um, they're just in a different place um, in their growth. So I don't, I don't need to put them down, you know, because I see where you guys are actually like really meant to be. It's a very special match, even if it's not exactly syncing up right now. They're just, um, they just need more time. And walking away will make them move all uh, much faster that I, I mean there it is knight of pentacles in reverse seeing these page of wands come through is like don't worry you'll hear from them you will you will hear from them walking away you won't lose them it's actually what you need to do to get the connection on track to get things moving in the right way it's what makes this person become um less blind to their own behavior it, and it actually makes them it makes them open up more, makes them put their guard down and put in more effort. Okay, Gemini, I love you all so much. That is what I can see for your message for October. You guys, please don't forget to like the video, comment, subscribe. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Thank you for everything. And I will talk to you all in a few days.